Yeah, I feel like a doctor's appointment. Sorry, can I, I can I cut, cut? <clears throat> Three, two, one. You know, I feel like a doctor's appointment is the only appointment where it always ends up being shorter than you want it to be. Every other appointment, you know, you got to renew your car insurance. You're like, just wait in the car. I'll be out in 15 minutes. Doctor's appointment, you know, your appointment's at 9. You show up at 8.55. You're sitting in the lobby until 9.20. They say, right this way, sir. They take your height and weight and then make fun of you a little bit. Then they go, you can go into this room. You're waiting in the room till 9.45. The doctor comes in and says, so why are you wasting my time? And you're like, mm, I have a little bit of a sore throat. And they're like, mm, go home. Go, go home and get some rest. It's like a two minute long uh, appointment. Everything else, if you gotta, God, God help you if you have to like, um, you know, renew your debit card in person at the bank, it'll take you like two hours. You'll sign a thousand forms. Um, at the doctor, it, it takes an hour just to see them even if you have an appointment and then they give you uh, four minutes with which they will regale you with their expertise. So that's, I'm going to see the doctor soon. If you're watching on YouTube, what about spa sessions? I've never done a spa session, but I feel like it lasts exactly as long as you book for. Is that not the case? Best of luck today. Thank you, thank you. I don't even know, like the, the bits are almost getting too dark. In British Columbia, you actually, it's probably true with other provinces as well. I don't know like how the medical system works where you live, but we have access to like an app that gives us our own health records. So I can look at my own health records I've been checking to see like if my blood test and stool sample results from last week have come back. Finally today, my blood test came back and I'm not qualified to interpret them, but I got it. They got to get a UX designer on this immediately because the first thing I saw when I opened up my, my blood test results was, um, it was like test, HIV, result, in range. And then a, a big green check mark. And I was like, um, excuse, like I just started like involuntarily shaking. Then I thought about it for like two seconds and I was like, okay, that's right. In range with a green check mark means that the test results are normal. Um, and then I checked the ones that were out of range and had a big red X. And uh, those ones were like, hey, this one tests for signs of infection. This one tests for um, uh, bacterial presence. And I was like, okay, so just take the ones that look like they're, um, that look like they're uh, present and then reverse them. So, so yeah, I don't fully know how to interpret my blood test results, but you know, that's kind of more for the doctor today anyway.